What is up everyone, this is Mo Gaming here. Today I'm going to show you how to stop lagging in Fortnite in 2024. So let's get right into this. So what you want to do is you want to click onto the top right to get to your section over here. You want to click into the settings menu over here and we're going to do a couple of things. The first thing is changing it from full screen to windowed full screen for some reason makes the lag go away. I have no idea. It has probably something to do <coughs> with the resolution, but this makes the lag go away. So I would highly recommend you to change it to windowed full screen. Next, in the resolution, you don't need to change this, but because this is more for your display resolution, resolution, if you can change it, go for it, play around with it, but I don't think you need to change that one. So that one's usually fine. Now, the next thing is your FPS. This is one thing that can make it lag. So I would recommend you kind of going off of what your computer is capable of and what your, I guess your consistency is with your graphic card and everything. I like 60, it works for me. I could probably do much, much higher because of my graphic card, <coughs> but for me, 60 ends up being pretty well. Over here, I would highly recommend you to do performance. This does lower the graphical fidelity, as it says, but it causes a significant performance. It even says performance is a mode that offers significant performance gain by disabling most rendering features to reduce memory <coughs> usage and lighten the load on GPU and CPU. So I would highly recommend you to doing on the performance side and going from there. The next thing you want to do, uh, we're going to turn off motion blur. We're going to... for. for for this one, we don't want it on auto set. We actually want to change the graphic quality to something that we want to specifically do ourselves. So this one, you want to keep it on low. Uh, you can keep this 3D resolution, make it 100%. You don't want this on 70. Uh, turn this off for dynamic 3D. Turn this off. You can keep this off. Basically, you're making everything low. You don't want it on medium. You want this basically low. You want this off. You want this off, off, off. Low, or sorry, low, 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 near, etc. You want to have those settings for those. So this is the things that you do in the video side. In the game side, we're going to change the. We're gonna go. Let me see. Uh, building. Uh, nope, not building. I'm trying to find where the exact section was. Replays right here. In replays, we're gonna turn this off. This even says turning off replays. Wait, where did it go? It's right here. Turn replay recording on off when replays are recorded and stored after each match. Recording replays can reduce performance and take a part in a So this is actually, you don't need this. Trust me, you don't need replays. Turn this off. This is probably one of the final things you can do to enhance your speed. It will make the lag go away and you will be good to go. So yeah, that's basically it. If you guys are like the video, please smash the like button. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell. I'm out. Peace.